Now to the state of our schools, where one of the nation's top health experts says it's time to consider easing pandemic restrictions, including in schools. News 12's Jonathan Gordon is outside School 22 in Yonkers. Jonathan, help explain what the former FDA commissioner, Dr. Scott Gottlieb, is suggesting here. Yeah, he's saying that uh, the CDC may want to start taking a look at some of its guidance and some of its baseline levels, some of the ways that it helps guide public health and to consider the amount of vaccination and the amount of immunity people have in the pandemic to help open up and ease things up just a little bit faster. On Wednesday, Assembly Republicans released this letter to Governor Kathy Hochul, calling on her to end the mask mandate. They're the latest group asking when pandemic restrictions will ease up as COVID cases plummet. And speaking on CNBC's Squawk Box Wednesday, former FDA Commissioner Dr. Scott Gottlieb says the CDC's current baseline to ease mitigation measures like masking is too conservative and could cause students a chance at returning to normalcy this spring. Some local parents agree. I will prefer they have a choice to wear them or not. But the future of masking in schools is uncertain in New York. Hochul hinted the end of the mandate isn't far off, but has not laid out a plan. Instead, saying the major COVID metrics like cases, hospitalizations, and vaccinations will guide her without providing specifics. Others, like eight-year-old Mariana, don't mind the masks. I wear it so my brother can get, so he can be safe. On Wednesday, Hochul announced 80% of 12 to 17 year olds have at least one COVID shot, a new milestone, but just one third of five to 11 year olds have done the same, potentially holding up easing restrictions. So Jonathan, when could we possibly get an answer on masking in New York? Here's what we do know. The governor extended the indoor mask mandate until February 10th, that's next week, and she did commit to relooking at the data every couple of weeks, every two weeks to be exact, to make a decision on whether to extend that mandate or make some changes. So next Thursday could be the next opportunity, if the governor doesn't decide between now and then, to see if there are any changes that she plans to make to any pandemic restrictions. We'll send it back to you.